Around the world today, we are celebrating the Lunar New Year. And if you were born in 1959, 1971, 1983, just a few of these those years, every 12, of course, you are the year of the pig, my son, 2007. Aww. Yeah. Okay, let's get into it. The color, culture, traditions. Please welcome Editor-in-Chief of Fetch Chinoise, Deborah Lau Yu. Good morning. Good morning. Happy this New, is New Year. You, <laughs> sorry, I jumped. Happy New Year. <laughs> this is just beautiful, though. Thank you. Well, today we have um, beautiful flowers here from Nicholas at uh, Opening Night Flowers, and we want to really celebrate Chinese New Year in a refreshing style, because usually we have a lot of red, and we do have red here, yeah. but we want to showcase all the symbolism that can come from the history of our culture, such as this yellow top. Yes, tell us. Yes, so yellow and gold were traditionally completely forbidden for citizens, okay. because it was reserved only for the emperor mm -hmm. and the empress and the royal family. But in 2019, you know, just a few hundred years later, we are all able to wear it, and it represents completeness, um, you know, regality, and just really a lot of joy. So just like this table, we want to showcase multiple colors of the culture. It is just stunning. It's so elegant. Yeah, tell, tell us a little bit about what's on top of the plates and the, and the colors. Rog likes his binoculars. Them. They're not I'm binoculars, these. These, are, <laughs> yeah. these are telling our fortune for next year. Look at projecting into the future. Okay, sorry. <laughs> tell us a little more. I, we're going to read these in a minute, but tell us a little more about what's on the plates and everything. Yeah, so, well, first of all, we want to combine something that is, you know, art, tradition, culture, and luxury together. Um, so we have beautiful, uh, you know, plates and chopsticks here from Tiffany and Co. Wow. And it just shows that this, you know, this wheat leaf pattern is a little bit symmetrical and geometrical, just like Chinese um, architecture mm -hmm. and when you combine it with traditional elements it can really come out so what you were holding were these are actually scrolls that we ah. created at Palaterra and if you open them and slide them off they're actually well wishes inside and so it's a great way to educate your, your kids Aww. at home or to wish your friends um, a happy new year and it's also learn so some beautiful. Chinese. Happiness as deep as the sea. Yes. Safe travels wherever you go. I love this. This Arts is so together beautiful. together is one. These are gorgeous. And you also have some inspiration from Crazy Rich Asians film success and yes. book success. Totally. And that's what gave us also the further courage to do it like this because traditionally our culture is seen as red and only red, which it is very important, like I mentioned earlier. Mm. But I think this year is no better time to actually get colorful. And so we incorporated a few touches that are taken from the movie poster. So all these beautiful orchids, um, you know, that Nicholas has done here. This was actually taken from, uh, you know, the, the, the peacock and the different like, fan shapes from, from the actual poster. But they represent harmony, marriage, love, and oh, romance. Beautiful. So, I love orchids. What's a traditional meal? What, can, what would people expect for a traditional meal? For the oh, year? it's like 10 courses. So you <laughs> have everything. It has She's to have a, a little bit. I think hours. I want to celebrate the new year. <laughs> Let's get right to dessert. A little sure. dessert moment over here. Mm -hmm. In how? adorable are these festive macarons in the shape of little piggies. Yeah, so these are made by Melly Eats World. I mean, she has like 100,000 followers because she's so passionate wow. about it. And every year she creates these little cute zodiac moments um, in macaron. And this here is a representation of how you can really create a tea and dessert moment for your guests when they arrive. Mm -hmm. So you're taking family heirlooms. This is actually authentically from my own family. Oh, my nice. great uncles, very fine porcelain. But when you mix and match them with modern modern items, it's really, it comes to life and there's a story. Yeah. And here I want to point out these beautiful desserts. They're created by Chef Bernard at Tasty Bakery. And um, he's just at, you know, Don Mills and York Mills, and he's so passionate about bringing new flavors to life. So what do you have there? It looks like a sponge cake, and what's on the inside filling? So he's based them on Hong Kong um, cafe menus. So there's actually a lemon Coke flavored cake. A vanilla bean and red bean ice Hold cream. Hold on, lemon cake. Coke? Yes. Like Coca Cola? Ooh, Coca Cola. Okay. So there's jellies inside that he's, you know, infused. And those, I sh I'm sure everyone has seen a little bit of this at some point in yeah. their lives. They're like pineapple buns. But actually, there's a twist. So inside is actually a Hong Kong milk tea and coffee mousse. Mm. Oh, yeah. And what are these? These are important, aren't they? Mm -hmm. So these are one of our three Fet Chinois limited edition Lucky Money pockets this year. And we're all about design changing the world. And so so these are, are a new take, 2019 take on Lucky Money Pockets. Very cool. And there are hundreds. Money in it for you, though. Well, you well, know, you so, so you're not going to have a lot of luck. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we will fill it and give it to someone else, right? Yes. That's beautiful. Everybody, we want you to celebrate the Year of the Pig with Omni. They are mm -hmm. showcasing a variety show made up of performances, cooking, fashion, music, and so much more, and giveaways. Watch it this Sunday on Omni 2. 6 p.m. is the Mandarin edition. 7 p.m. is the Cantonese edition to everybody celebrating. Happy Lunar New Year. Happy New Year. Thank you. Let's head upstairs now to Mel. Oh.